everyone welcome back to the right nurse today i'll be doing my part two of my supply haul for nursing school if you like to see the other things that i got including these books please continue watching all right guys i'm just going to jump into the supply haul it's going to be pretty short and sweet um it was just a few little odds and ends and mainly the books that i'll be showing today that i needed for school as you can see, these are all the books that I did purchase for nursing school. Um, if you're able to see, some have yellow tabs on them. They are used. So I was able to get some of the books used, but you're looking at $1,000 worth of books. Ridiculous. I did not, I mean, I did know actually because I'm nosy and I kind of researched. The books are freaking expensive. It's just, it's ridiculous how expensive the books are. So I'm just going to quickly read through them. So I have the, um, a concept based approach to nursing this is a part one part two and a part three volume um they came together that was like seven hundred dollars i do remember that set alone then of course pharmacology fundamentals of success nursing diagnosis handbook davis's drug guide and jarvis physical examination and health assessment book so yeah i walked out the bookstore like one, my arms were about to break because damn books are heavy. I hope we do not have to carry these books to class. But other than that, my heart hurt, y'all. My heart hurt. Those books were freaking expensive. But I kind of anticipated it. But still, just putting out $1,000 for nursing books, it sucks. I mean, some, I mean, on the other hand, you can rent the books. But I know, like, nine times out of ten, I will be referring back to these books probably even after nursing school for the NCLEX for studying and everything so I was just like you know what I'll just purchase them so I can always have them in my arsenal so moving on I also had to purchase this big ugly black bag full of nursing supplies um I kind of took a peek in there but I was just so over the amount of money that I spent that day in the bookstore I didn't really give a damn what was inside the bag so I'm just gonna quickly go through what's inside the bag so it comes with the trait care kit um next we have some gauze sponges and forgive me if i pronounce this stuff wrong look i haven't started nursing school yet okay so bear with me so this is it looks like a suction catheter kit some tubing what else is inside here it looks like it's a lot inside this is looks like it's mainly for catheter care from what I see and but then I do see some IV stuff in here I'm not gonna open it just because it's packaged nicely and I'm just gonna leave it but next now this wasn't actually in the bag I did purchase these separately I'm just gonna call them scissors you guys because I don't know what kind of scissors there are to be quite honest but there's some type of scissors medical scissors okay so I did purchase these separately they were like $5.99 a piece and of course um these are just patches I have to put on my uniforms um one just says student nurse which I'm excited about and then the other is just my school name so they actually aren't on but I'm just gonna take mine to the seamstress just to sew them on because probably after like five washes washes they'll end up falling off anyway so I'm just gonna have mine sewn on Next, this is a silicone Foley catheter with 2,000 milliliters anti-reflux drainage bag and needleless sampling port. That was a mouthful. Um, and this looks like another catheter or whatever. I don't know, y'all. It comes with a balloon urine collection valve lubricating it just looks like another catheter like I feel like we're gonna do a lot of catheter care in my first you know nursing class there must be a lot of that going on um this is just an irrigation tray with piston syringe yeah a lot of stuff you guys again this is yeah this all this stuff is a lot of catheter care I'm not quite sure I guess this will be what we'll pretty much be going for the first semester and another trait care kit so yeah but the good news even though I spent like eleven hundred dollars all together all the stuff that I purchased will take me through the entire program so I put the money out up front and I won't have to spend any more on books or supplies so that's one thing I am really happy about um the last thing I will show you guys is the shoes I purchased 
These are Cherokee footwear. We had to do all white shoes. Um, I actually brought these two shoes when I had to do the CNA course earlier last year, spring of last year. On a scale of 1 to 10, I will rate these probably like a 7. Because they're comfortable, but they're not they're not comfortable. Like, I'm kind of flat-footed, so these kind of have more of an arch. So when I wear them, I'm kind of like, they're comfy, but then they're not that comfortable. But I did not get used to them. I have some other shoes that I have that I wear to work that are actually a lot more comfor comfortable than these. But these are still a good shoe. One thing I do like is that a lot of, I notice a lot of nursing programs, they make you wear white tops and white bottoms. Well, my program doesn't, thank God. We have to do white tops and hunter green bottoms. So, I love that. I don't know what it is. I just think the whole white bottom thing is just tacky. Like, you gotta really be cautious of the color underwear you wear. You know, I'm a woman, so our monthlies, like, it's just, no. No, I like the green. It's not my favorite color green, but I do like the fact that it's, it's not all white. So, yeah. But honestly, guys, that's just the rest of the supplies that I had to get for school. I mean, if you want to see, like, more detailed of the little things I brought, like, my, um, my clinical bag and some of the other supplies, like the whiteboard and everything, please watch part two. This one was just, like, the ending of my supply haul for school. I literally start on Monday, so I'm so excited. Um, I probably will be vlogging my first day in nursing school. I'm such a damn nerd, but yeah, stay tuned. Again, thank you guys for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.